Newcastle won, Arsenal nil, and we lose at the home of the Magpies. Yeah, to make to make as in Akuna to make a vizi, to make a vizi. Like there's nothing, there's no two ways about it. The only positive in our performance is Thomas party. Party, his awareness in space. He Ameka say Chobo. He was not being beaten when he was at right back to ki attack and invert Vizuri. Like he he played well. He played well. The only the only shining light kwa performance ya leo. Um, obviously, oh, the other one, maybe, Nwaneri coming on after 60 minutes. He was given 30 minutes. Many fans have been crying for him to play, uh, to get more game time. But today is a prime example that shows us he's still not ready. Definitely, he made a difference when he came on, but it's 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 a different level above. And I can see why Ateta is protecting him. But it would be very unfair of me to say that we were bad and not, and not say how good Newcastle are. So... That is the last I'm talking about my team. I'm only going, I'm going to talk about Newcastle. Newcastle looked very good. Um, I can't believe I'm going to say this, but Eddie Howe actually outclassed Ateta today. He did. I know we have injuries, but to make one injury, I they got for how long? No one, well, Bournemouth beat us. Nandio to make up leo. Many other teams didn't manage to beat us. So we need to give credit to Iraola, Coach Bournemouth, na Eddie Howe. Eddie Howe leo amefanya tu kitu too simple. I'm going to say, so he had a ball, mjaribu press, ka soft press, ikikata murudi nyuma. And that is how Livramento and Lewis Hall for me were the best players on the field. They were easily the most impactful players on the field. Lewis Hall against Saka on one wing uh, did very well. Livramento really just nullified Martinelli. Um but also because of how we are playing, ni katuna tunalazim shamba Martinelli Martinelli kupata ball nje kabisa, apart from say one on one vizuri. He was getting the ball in places that are not dangerous for us. So, um, and we played in their favor. And Newcastle took it with two hands. Wakasama, hii, tunamaliza. Another person whose work rate was insane today was Anthony Gordon. Umsa mekimbia. Considering alikuwa na injury ya groin last week, na amecheza leo karibu 80-something minutes. Amecheza how many minutes? Amecheza... Amecheza... Amecheza 85 minutes. So considering I'm going to injury a groin, I'm at 85 minutes. If you've ever had a groin injury, you know how painful that thing is and coming back from it. So Yeku Rudy and actually putting in a performance like that, um, and on top of that, putting in one of the assists of the season so far, the cross was beautiful. Nilikuwa nime tweet, the cross was beautiful. Nikambi wapo na bestiangu okwara ati kama tunge mark. Kama saliba na Gabriel angefanya job poa ku mark, ainge kuwa bao. But atuku mark <laughs> to be much awazi katikati and Gordon picked him out. So it has to be a great assist, you know. If Msekaki did back for Nyotuna Sama, wow, Msanim Pasam Kali, Lazima to Patana credit Pali. Uh, wait, do direct translation. So, yeah, Eddie Howe was really good today. Uh, mm, Obviously, Isaac getting at, at the end of that was was crucial, Get putting it 1 0. We only managed one shot on target in the entire game. To lipata moja ile nyeli block your line. And after you to menyamaza to Harvard, amenyamaza. Like he was he was working hard but hardly working. <laughs> you can see him working hard. Unazona na kimbia unazona na press. But it's not leading to anything, you know. So ah uh, yeah. Leo, kwanza the first like 15 minutes, Newcastle's midfield was just outrunning ours. Like it didn't make sense at all. I and the thing is, we really want to Without Odegaard, it's very obvious we're trying to play through Trossard. So they're just putting three or four people on him. Uh, Joe Linton, na, Nani, um, Sean Longstaff, Joe Linton, Bruno G. Anytime Trossard had a ball, they were going to attack, they were going to And they were really nullifying us. Saka had moments on his wing, but still nothing. Again, Luis Hall, Livramento, very, very good today. We did not test Nick Pope at all. Like, I don't think he even made a save. The, our shot on target was a block. It wasn't even a Nick Pope save. So we're not creating chances. We are not... Um, we, we, we just didn't play well. And a big chunk of that is because of Eddie Howe. Declan Rice's deliveries today one. As much as nearly shout last time, because the delivery of Bolia Merino and Merino Lifunga, eh, Karibu Nigua, and Merino Lifunga Champions League, this is, this is now <laughs> the complete opposite. He had so many chances and good free kicks. And... He just couldn't get it right. In fact, there was one that was so embarrassing. I met up a free kick, I met up a Gordon, the first man. Gordon, I can't even remember And we were defending a we were defending a counter. So 
Yeah, Rice's delivery was was not great um, today. He had one good chance at the end. Your header should have done better. But upon looking at the replay, I think lose two balance. I think Ilikuwa Fabian Shah, Ahmad Danban. That did just enough to put him off balance. So all in all, we didn't deserve we didn't we didn't deserve anything from this game today. Kusamatu we didn't deserve a single thing from this game. Newcastle were better than us. Eddie Howe outcoached, outclassed Ateta on the day. Um yeah, and we move on. Good thing ni e weekend Chelsea not a manu pia kumanisha mutu lazima umie. So to kwa pike to msijali e weekend lazima mtu wa umie. Uh, Man City pia kwa na manja risk other sijui kwa ta chapa bone mouth but um tunaomba Liverpool ta chapa Brighton anyway worst case scenario this weekend we are going 8 points behind the league leaders Man City and yeah already it's a daunting challenge knowing next week we're going to Chelsea yeah tough two losses two away losses in a row after not losing any away game in 2024 we are definitely in a in a slump so Yeah, let's see how we do against Inter at the San Siro in midweek.